On Friday, February 22nd, 13 Lancers competed for the title of Mr. LHS. The night consisted of dancing, pickup lines, talents, and formal wear. This was my first time doing Mr. LHS, and I thought it was a lot of fun. It was a little nerve-wracking being out there with like 300 people. It was kind of scary, but it was a lot of fun to see everyone progress, and we kind of bonded together, and it wasn't really competitive. We were all kind of a team. No matter who won, we were all happy, and I thought it was a really fun experience. Well, the experience this year at Mr. LHS was really fantastic. I think the, all the crowd loved it. They were chanting names. They were clapping a lot. Before appearing on stage, the boys practiced their talents along with the group dance during rehearsal. I really didn't feel any pressure because I've done a lot of stuff in theater. I've sang a lot in front of, on front of big crowds and stages, so it felt just like a normal performance. But uh, yeah, it was, it was uh, obviously just like we have a bit of like butterflies in your stomach, but once you get up there, you're, you're feeling great. I just try to get as good as I could at my acts and the like times that I, the opportunities I got during the practices and rehearsals. I just knew I was good at deadlifting, so I decided to do that. The four finalists were Joe Quick, Mr. Choir, Vernon Wind, Mr. AFJ ROTC, Walker Treishman, Mr. LTC, and Jacob Ward, Mr. Student Publications. I feel fantastic. Uh, you know, sometimes you win, sometimes you lose, but it was a good time, you know. I had a lot of fun, so and I got the certificate to prove it. After a final round of questioning, Jacob Ward, Mr. Student Publications, was crowned Mr. LHS. I'm happy that I won. I'm proud that I, like, all the things that I did to prepare for the competition paid off in a way, so I'm, I'm happy about that. I hope in the future years we'll have more and more contestants so it's even more thrilling. Reporting for the Lancer Feed, this is Jonah Nickerson.